Good morning, Joe. How are you? I'm doing well. Thank you. Um, all right, so let's start with vaccines. We were just telling people about Pfizer and the fact that the 12 to uh, 15 age group has opened up for for people in that uh, area, which is a large portion of the community and throughout the United States uh, going to be a big factor in getting to herd immunity. Where does the county stand on giving out those shots today? You know, uh, late last night, we heard from our state officials that uh, the federal and state uh, safety review experts are recommending vaccine as a safe and effective at protecting young people 12 and above. So we are uh, poised to begin. We know that uh, in our Santa Barbara community, uh, our healthcare providers, such as uh, Cottage Hospital, have been opening uh, appointments to the 12 plus. So I strongly recommend families, uh, parents and guardians to book appointments for their families who are 12 and above. Uh, not only is Cottage providing that, but our pharmacies as well as our Santa Barbara uh, County Public Health Departments through our mobile clinics, we will be doing uh, offering the, uh, uh, the vaccine at school-based clinics as well. And starting on, on Sunday, our Santa Maria uh, uh, Fair Park will have will be uh, vaccinating 12 plus as well. Uh, we actually are at one of those clinics that's underway with Cottage Hospital right now. They're doing it where it's open for people, no appointments necessary. Uh, and I know when it comes to appointments for vaccines, this has kind of been opened up to even if you don't have an appointment, right? Anybody can go pretty much anywhere to, to go get a shot through public health. That is correct. We want to make sure that vaccines are easy and it's it's uh, accessible and convenient for our community members. So uh, please check our website at publichealthsbc.org for all the different uh, vaccination opportunities in our community. And most of them do not require appointments. You can do walk ups. And how many, uh, what is the percentage of Santa Barbara County that's now fully vaccinated or at least one shot? We're getting, you know, improving numbers every day. Yes, so we're we're at about the uh, sixty one percent of all of our eligible populations are uh, have received at least one shot. So that that's really good news. Um, but we have a little bit more ways to go, and that's why we really need everyone to make that decision uh, to get vaccinated. And now with the expansion to uh, uh, twelve and above. Um, we have that opportunity. Vaccines are plentiful. There's no appointments necessary, and we need everyone to make that decision so that we as a community can reach that 80%. Uh, Vondo Renoso, thank you so much for joining us here on Midday.